Um, I picked a seven because, well, I'm a good jazz dancer. Um, because she was good, but she wasn't like. Mm, I love you. Um, the red are awesome. The red are cool. We vlog at the pool. And we vlog at your school. We vlog as a family. We vlog every day. Hey, good morning. It's Monday. Hope everyone's Monday is doing good. We uh, had a little bit of rain overnight. Not sure if you can see in the background, but the ground's all wet. Um, some rain we needed, but the forecast for this weekend was supposed to be 60% of rain, rain all weekend. We got our first rain last night. They canceled the race in uh, Concord, which is a couple towns over. Weatherman, he blew it big time. I mean, didn't even come close to raining here. Anyway, um, kids got up super late. It looked like everybody at school got up super late. Lines were big, it's tough to get in, but we made it. A um, little bit of a rush, a little bit of a panic, but between the hair and the shoes and the socks and the texting mom, we got it done um, once again. But uh, a lot of other people were getting in there late, so oh well, it stinks for them. All right, Monday, here we go. Oh yeah, one last thing. I came out this morning. See the, see these drips here? These were ice. Um, windshield was frozen too. That's how cold it was out this morning. We had a freeze warning. Um, I need to plant grass here soon. That's one of my plans. Notebook? Yeah. You got a Paris notebook? Uh, notebook. Is it a notepad? Postcards. Mm. Paris postcards. I like the bag. Is there anything else in here? I see the card. Mm -hmm. Emily got her uh, Ooh. present from Aunt Sandy. What's this? Her birthday present. A little late. But... Oh, it's an eraser. Oh, cool, dude. Look, Mom. Eiffel Tower oh, cool. eraser. Oh. Show me the card. It looks like a cool card. Oh, yeah. It is a cool card. That's why it was so poofy out. That's I was like, cool why card. is it so big and poofy? It's a poofy and big one. I love the list. So that's cool you got a fifty tunes on a fifty dollar iTunes gift card. And Sandy's a nice girl, huh? Alright, so uh the girls, they left me. They don't want to be around me no more. Now, Emily had to uh, bring back a um, return umbrella at one of the stores. She bought it and it wasn't working, it was broken, so she wanted to return it. Um, had dinner, just an average dinner. Basically had whatever we had uh, left in the house. We're trying to clean up the fridge before we go shopping again next time. Um, I'm not sure if you can hear the noise in the background. Can you hear that? It's power washer. They've been power washing all day. These houses aren't that big. I don't know what they're power washing. Even if they did the driveway, the house, maybe they're doing the inside of the house. They're pressure washing the inside of the house. Maybe that's what's going on. I don't know, but they've been pressure washing all day long. Um, as you can see, I'm still wearing a jacket because it's still cold. For reason that is. Um, yeah, it's supposed to get down to the 40s again tonight. Maybe even 30s. Um, but not cold enough to freeze like last night. Anyway, waiting for the girls to come home. Uh, we'll see what they have to say. They didn't, they didn't really have much to say about school today, so uh, we'll ask them some questions when I get back. All right, it's that time of year again. Just dancing with the stars. Girls are watching the first episode tonight, and we, they just had the first dancer, Kim Fields. Um, I picked a seven because, well, I'm a good jazz dancer. Okay. And she was kind of doing a little slow. Um, and they should have like did a black back flip or something. Okay. To make... Is she gonna win the whole thing competition? Mm, no, definitely okay. not. So I think also a seven <laughs> um, because she was good, but she wasn't like good, good. Like she was good, but she like wasn't that good. I mean, it is her first week, so that's why we did give her such a... She won the competition? 
I think jo Jody Sweeten and um, whatever his name is. All right, after round two, we had a costume change. Yeah. I picked an eight, but they got a seven. Okay. I picked a seven, and they got seven. Is she going to win the whole thing? Is she going to win the whole thing, Abigail? Okay, Paige and Mark. Paige is a uh, UFC fighter. Give the people a five because I didn't see a thing. How come? Because you turned it off. Mm -hmm. I didn't see it so. So give it a four. Question mark. You think Doug's gonna win it all? I don't know because I didn't even see it. Yeah, we didn't. Sh I turned the TV off because the Thank girls uh, made a mess in the kitchen. And the mother asked them to clean it up. I know you didn't. I just saw some of it. That would be. <laughs> anyway. All right. Here, here are the scores that they're getting. <laughs> they gave them the right scores. Wow. I guess Doug, Doug didn't. Doug didn't do so good. Huh? For Jody and Keo, what did you give them? I gave them nine. <laughs> are they gonna win the whole thing? And they don't have to be right, by the way. You're gonna um, give a seven, eight, Emily? Yeah. Nice. Seven. Six. I give Edit on Galala a seven and a six. Hold on. Seven and a six? Okay. I don't see any of that because I was on the toilet. Okay, so you're gonna seven? I'll give him a five. Yay! Dun, dun, Edit to Ono Geraldo? What? Edit to Ono Geraldo? I thought Antiana, whatever his name was, and Lindsay both got an eight, and they did. Boys to men, boys yeah. to men guy, he did good, yeah. didn't he? I think the Antonio and Lindsay guy are gonna win the whole thing. Wow, that's Emily coming out with a strong prediction early. All right, Abigail, Marlon, and Tony, what, how'd they do? Eight, and good. Some of them should know how to do this. Someone did. Someone did. I think Lindsay did with uh, the boys to men guy. He was great. They were great. They were good. Somebody should have done this too. She's giving them an eight. Oh, did I show you that I can do this? Wait. All right, it's enough, dude. Wow. I thought they got a five, even though they got second place in the leaderboard. What are you talking about? Marsha Cox? Misha and Antonio. Misha and Antonio. Oh no. Misha and Antonia. And just, just. Anyway. I got a five. Oh, Peter and Niall got a five. Okay. Do you think they're gonna win the whole thing? Mm -hmm. You don't? Abigail. They just blew everyone away. Peter and Niall for you, Abigail. What? Um, five. I give Sharna and Antonio a nine. I give Whitney and Vaughn a nine too. Who do you think is going to win the whole season? I think it might be them, them, or them. Okay. Them. I give Sharna and Antonio a nine. All right. I give Whitney and Vaughn a nine. Perfect. Who do you think is going to win the whole thing? Mm, yeah, mm, yeah. Oh, the boys to men guy? All right. Okay, here's who the girls think are the finalists are going to be for the 2016 Dancing with the Stars. All right, that's it for Dancing with the Stars, night one, season 22, I think? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the girls uh, giving their scores. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Be the best human being you could be, and we'll see you tomorrow. Are you ready for some more rye breads? Yeah, me too. Just click over here to check out our family's journey. We're a family of four here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Just uh, providing some daily entertainment on YouTube. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching.